Hello everybody. Today we was at the beach and it was really beautiful. Not too many people, but it was beautiful, nice. And now tonight we want to make pork chop. Pork chop with a fig. I got so many fig and I say let's do it with a fig. And we got over here white and black. I call it like this, white and black. And we got a little bit of oil and babe I got to use. This is the pork chop and butter. And I got to use a little balsamic vinegar. Okay, now, to start, I bring the pork chop right over here on the stove. Hello, Bill. And we put the gas on. And we put a little oil. Not too much oil, but after we can put a little bit more oil. Uh, how is everybody doing tonight? Okay, we warm up this oil now. Hello, the, Carol. For the pork chop. Jeremy's not here tonight. Just us. And before we start, let's drink a little. Okay. Hello, Leslie. Salute e chin chin, everybody. Chin chin. Such a beautiful day. Okay. Now, let's start. I want to make a nice color for the pork chop. Okay, I got this on, on the media. Now, the time of the pork chop, you gotta cook on one side. Let's go over here. Okay, for the pork chop, I want to use, a, for the fig, I use a little butter though. I put it right over here. And this is the fig. Now, the fig, what I do, I cut it on a four piece, like this, and like that. Salut, Chin Chin, Leslie. Okay. And he was, he got so many fig this year. Really lot. Okay. It's, a, it's so sweet. Thank you for the stars. Thank you, thank you, everybody. Yeah, we have so many figs this year. It's unbelievable how beautiful they are. Yeah, I got it. Hello, Billy. Hello. Hello, Carol. Yeah, I like to put a little hot pepper, not too much. Only to give a good taste, because the pig is so sweet. Okay. Yeah, mix it together. Okay, let me wash my hair, because the pig is really sweet and sticky. Got a lot of sugar. Yeah, they're very, they very good. So sweet. Now, we see the pork chop. Salute Chin Chin and thank you so much for the start. Chin Chin, salute.
We cook a little bit more this after we put the fig. Now, the pork chop, I'm making sure they don't cook it too long either. Because if you cook it too much, it becomes so dry. How is everybody doing tonight? Good? Everybody's fine? All right, I got a cleaning dish over here for the pork chop. Great. How is the weather, Leslie, at your place now? Is it all better? All good, perfect, great. Okay, the pork chop is done. A oh, 90, so it's good. I figure I'm going to break this again and I'm going to pull it together. Hello, Rick. Storm in yeah, Florida. Hello, Tina. Then we put a clean of oil. Okay, I like to use a little butter. We're making pork chop with figs. Just cook the pork chop. Now we gotta do the figs. Doesn't to caramelize them. <laughs> no. Actually, we will be eating just that with the salad. But you can use with uh, mashed potatoes. You can use with pasta, with risotto, or just like salad. I know it's a lot. <laughs> It's so good. Okay. Salute, chin chin, everybody. Chin chin. Billy, say how many cups you have of figs over there. Well, the fig really is like a fuck up. But I got so many more. You got a lot of pig outside. Look at that, look at that. Well, this is like Italian figs, so he don't know exactly the name. He's calling them white and brown. I call a white, white fig a black fig. This is for Italy, come on, this. Look, you see now? Look, it's already, look. Everything is started. Okay, now what I gotta do, I gotta put the pork chop over here. 
But before I put the pork chop, I want to put a little balsamic vinegar. Oh, Billy got a martini. Enjoy your martini, Bill. Okay, a little balsamic vinegar. All right. It smells so good. Just amazing. Now I put a little salt on a fig. Thank you, Leslie. A little black pepper. Thank you, Tina. How are you doing? Everything is good? Getting ready to retire? <laughs> ah, Billy has <laughs> pork chops and peppers. Ah, very similar. Oh, wow. you got all your baby. <laughs> so enjoy it too. That it looks amazing. Mm, Look at that. Smells so good too. Ah, 22 weeks. Wow, it goes fast now. I'm sure you're counting the days. <laughs> okay. Look at the fig. The fig gets really, really, look at that. Yeah, beautiful. All right, we take this dish out. Smells so good. A knife for me. A some clean fish. Ah, uh, yeah, arugula will sounds good with that. Yeah, I got a lot of arugula. We, thank you, Leslie. And we use a little. That looks amazing. It smells really, really good. Look how beautiful now. Look at that. Yeah, huh? Huh? Ah, so you can try it, Tina, and let us know. really thick and all the fig look it's all break down it's so cool yeah grapes too yes you're right also grapes it's good with uh, a sausage we have to try it, the recipe to chicken and sausage. Okay, salute Chin Chin and thank you so much for your support and thank you for the style of Chin Chin. Salute. Okay. Oh, it looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like I say, the pork chop I like not too much to cook. My wife, she like a more cook. But Everybody, it's not the same, but I like it like this. And what I do, I want to take it out the one for me. It will low, really, really low the gas.
I know I prefer more cook too. <laughs> Okay, and this one, I leave really, really low for my wife. And now, let's go over here. Wow, it looks amazing. Okay, I bring in my wine. It smells so good too. Okay. It's not red, it's good. Mm. Have a twig. Mm. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. It's a little spice, very good. Mm? It's a coconut offer for me. Thank you very much for the look of this video. It came out really good. So you got a fig, you can do with a fig or you do something different. Salute, Chin Chin, and thank you so much for your support, and thank you for the start. Chin Chin, salute, and we'll see you next time. Chin Chin. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Leslie. Love to all also. Thanks for watching us again. Thank you.